The Russian S-350 Vitya air defense system shot down enemy aircraft for the first time in the fully automatic mode. Russian media on May 24th reported that the country's S-350 Vitya's air defense system shot down a Ukrainian plane for the first time in automatic mode after months of deployment on the Ukrainian battlefield. According to the source, the S-350 air defense system works in tandem in both active and passive radar modes. Thanks to this technique, it is possible to increase the protection of the complex from interference, as well as anti-radiation missile. In August 2022, evidence appeared on social media that the S-350 Vitiga air defense system was deployed at an air base less than 40 miles from the Ukrainian border. Reaction speed is the biggest advantage of the S-350 Vitiga air defense system, making it especially effective against cruise missiles. The S-350 Vitya is a Russian medium-range surface-to-air missile system developed by GSKB Armas Ante. Its purpose is to replace the S-300 PS. The system design choices its roots from the joint South Korean-Russian km sam project and uses the same 9M96 missile as the S-400 missile system. The S-350 was unveiled in 2013 and presented at that year's Mark Air Show. Initial plans called for the system's test phase to end in the autumn of 2013 and for the delivery of around 30 systems by 2020. However, the first deliveries of the S-350 only took place in 2019 and it only entered service in February 2020. According to Armas, VTS could replace older SAMs like the S-125 while adding multiple target and anti-missile capabilities. According to information released, the system can be delivered in two configurations, a version optimized for protecting against high-precision weapons able to simultaneously engage up to eight targets. There is a multi-role version. In the former configuration, the battery consists of a radar and up to four launchers with 32 small missiles each while in the latter, the heart of the battery is a mobile command post linked to up to two radars and up to eight launchers. The S-350E Vitya 50R6 missile system is mounted on an 8x8 truck chassis under the technical name of 50P6 is a dual missile system whereby each of the standard containers can be replaced by a pack of four smaller and shorter weapons. The vertical launcher truck carried 12 tubular containers in two lines of six. The missile for the S-350 E Vitya 50R6 is the 9M96 guided missile, which was originally designed for the S-400 system. This missile can be used against aerial and ballistic targets with a firing range from 1.5 to 120 km and to an altitude from 10 to 30,000 meters. It features passive IR homing guidance. The 9M96 is the dual-role anti-missile and anti-aircraft missile.
The S-350 can also fire 9M-100 guided missile to destroy aircraft, UAVs, and cruise missiles. The 9M-100 is a short-range IR guided missile that has been mentioned as both a surface-to-air missile and an air-to-air missile. It has a maximum firing range of 10 km. The S-350 VTR launcher missile canisters are mounted on the 8x8 truck chassis BAC-6909. The power plant comprising a 470 horsepower engine. The vehicle can run at a maximum speed of 80 km per hour with a maximum cruising range of 1000 km. S-350 is considered to have three times stronger combat capability with 12 missile control channels compared to four channels of the S-300 with a much higher level of informationization and automation than its predecessor. The system exceeded the performance of a medium-range air defense system with a range of 5 to 400 km and an altitude of 10 meters to subspace. Russian experts said that the official putting S-350 VTRs into operation also means that Russia has completed the three-stage defense system, sealing the defense hull of the R-S-300 system.